It's also Steve O'Donnell, the Chief Oper Operating Officer of NASCAR. So Matt, we'll let you start. Congratulations to everyone Comcast Xfinity on an outstanding 2022. Yeah, thank you, Marty, very much. It was a great season. And let me start by saying congratulations to Coach Gibbs, everybody at Joe Gibbs Racing, Toyota Racing, congratulations. You know, we say in the NASCAR Xfinity Series, names are made here. And I think it's really, really clear that Todd's been making his name since day one, winning his first ever race in our series, 11 wins, and now culminating it with the championship this year. So, Ty, on behalf of everybody at Comcast NBC Universal, congratulations on being the 2022 NASCAR Xfinity Series champion. All right, Steve, I'll let uh, I'll let you do the honors and have the next word here. Yeah, incredible battle with uh, Justin, Josh, and Noah. One of the best races I've seen. Uh, Ty, you delivered with the bright lights. We're proud to call you our 22 champion. Look forward to seeing you in the Cup Series as well. All right, time to hand out some hardware for that. We'll let Mr. O'Donnell do that. Ty Gibbs, the 2022 NASCAR Xfinity Series champion. He's got that trophy. Get in here and grab a word with uh, with Ty. Paul Dolschel from Toyota over here as well. So, Ty, you said this week... I let my family down. I even betrayed my family. Does that make it all the more sweeter to deliver a championship to them today? Uh, I just, you know, the mistakes I made last week were completely unacceptable. And the only thing I could have done this week is gone out there and win and drive respectfully. I feel like I did that. Um, and and thank you to my team. Once again, apologize again to the 19 team and our whole organization. But the only thing I knew moving forward is, is do better. That's what Ward Mara said. But you know, forget about that now. Um, it's time to celebrate a championship with all these guys' hard work. Um, and, and, and it's just amazing. In a way, did last week motivate you even more for today? Uh, not, I don't really believe in motivation. It's all temporary. Motivation's weakness. Rel relentlessness is infinity and, and lasts forever. So that's what that's what I uh, you know, keep my mind on and, and keep moving forward with. And, and you know, I love the racing so much that I'm not even motivated to do stuff. I love it. I love doing it. I love the work. We've talked about your emotions all week long, but what were your emotions after the checkered flag, and what thoughts did you have about the family and this organization? I'm just so excited to be honest with you. I feel like I was just so, I was built up with such energy that I didn't know what to do with myself. Um, you know, luckily, I didn't cry like I did when I won Daytona, so hopefully I matured a little bit, I guess. All right, were those the hardest laps you've ever driven in your entire life? Um, they were definitely really hard, and especially when I got to one of the teammates, I was a little scared, but you know he raced me well and, and let me go by. Um, and, and you know I respect I respect everybody. I feel like this whole week's given me a new you know perspective on racing and, and you know how to handle it.